Liberal Party presidential candidate, Mr. Peter B. Today in Benin City, their state capital, with a visit to the palace of the Oba of Benin, Obaiware II. He arrived to a surge of the party supporters who erupted into a frenzy at the palace where they had been waiting for him. Once in the presence of His Majesty, Mr. O.B. states his mission. We want to build Nigeria. We have a country called Nigeria, but we don't have Nigeria. We want to give the youth future. We have talented youth, too much in age. We want to put resources in their hand. We have vast and cultivated land in the north. That's our next story. That's where we want to. We want to work it. We want to be able to tell Niger that it wasn't a misplacement that we found all in your place. But to start a building, what do the government of empathy? If they're strong, who go sympathize with people, show that they're governor, that they're government. Meanwhile, the Oba Benin had his response to the Labour Party's presidential candidates, which must have sounded like music to his ears. Many people, many people that seem to be, that seem to be what they call obedient, that, have, that seem to be obedient, that's not what they say when they are with people. <laughs> I'm just, you know, just by, out of curiosity, out of curiosity, I was a small child. I was an old man, middle age. You just get a sense of what is really going on with this, this, uh, this new, this new guy in town. Do you know Peter B? I will ask the little child. Little child. Surprisingly, they'll say yes. I say, how do you know Peter B? When I say little child, I mean really little child, you know, between 12 and 14 or so thereabouts. And old men, old men also gray haired, 90 year old and all that. So I wonder if these people that are saying um, there's only social media, <laughs> if they have anyway. Let me let me not go there. Because here they believe so.